welcome back to my channel. A lot of you guys love these types of videos. Um, I like to show you guys my pick and save haul. Now pick and save is affiliate with Kroger. Now if you guys are not sure if you have a Kroger affiliated store, you just go to the Kroger.com, type in uh, stores near me and then they will tell you what stores are nearby. Um, my store is still called pick and save. It's, it's 50... 50% Kroger and like 50% pick and save. Um, otherwise, sorry, my son's not here and my my in-laws are letting me know when they're bringing them over. But uh, so what you guys just need to do is just go to Kroger.com and you guys can see if there's affiliate stores. There's a whole list of stuff. Um, I wish my store was 100% Kroger of, uh, owned. I mean, I don't mind that it's pick and save, but I wish it was 100% because they still don't follow the same exact rules or don't always have the same exact deals as Kroger. But I'm fine with what I got. Um, I used to hate shopping at pick and save back in the day. I hated it. What it is, it's, it's I have a grocery store that I shop at, and you guys always want to see me do grocery store hauls. Well... The grocery store that I do, they're so cheap. I don't really have coupons that I get there because a lot of the coupons that we get are a lot for processed foods, junk food and stuff, nothing really good. So I don't do a lot of hauls, but I'm thinking I should just do a grocery store haul and just show you guys what we buy. We just buy it on the whim, whatever. I do want to start doing all the grocery store hauls, but that's something I'm going to start doing in the future when I actually need groceries. But right now, um, we just kind of just get whatever. But what I'm going to do is they had the Mega 5 for 5 sale. Now, this sale just started yesterday, which was the 20th. So, uh, what is it? February 20th. So, it goes for two weeks, whatever two weeks is from now. Um, now, we are getting some coupons this weekend that you guys can use for this deal. Some of these coupons do expire this weekend. And then we're getting newer coupons that you guys can use. So, it just depends on when the coupons expire. Um, there's some really good freebies with Crest toothpaste that we'll be getting in the P&G. And there's a couple other things that, in case you guys are interested in that. Um, one thing I do, I'm going to tell you guys, is I do my pick and save uh, videos a lot differently than I do my other hauls. The reason is I get so much stuff, I don't want to do the breakdowns for you guys. So what I'm going to do is I have down written down what, what coupon it is. Um, you guys can, you know, write it down as you go. Or if you guys see a product that you want, what you guys can do is go to CouponTom.com. This is a website that I use. And that's how I can tell what coupon is where. So, like, if you guys didn't know on the inside of your inserts, there are dates on the side of your inserts, okay? So what you guys want to do, if you want to look for a suave coupon, you go to Coupon.com or CouponTom.com. You type in suave and it'll tell you what suave coupons are and what inserts. So... What I ended up doing is I did take a picture of the coupon that I used, which I will insert at the end of the video along with all the other coupons. But what I'm going to do is just kind of explain it to you guys, and then you guys can see the coupon with the product at the end of the video. It's just too much for me to edit for all these products, so just wanted to give you guys a heads up on that. Now I did use one of my little, uh, I actually used my Target thing, um, just because it's helpful. But if you guys are looking for more organized ways to write down your breakdowns, I do have a video listed below that you guys can watch. If you guys don't want to watch the video, that's fine. But just click on the video and then I have the link of the Google uh, thing that you guys can use. Um, you can't edit it, you just can print it off and use it. And I use that like crazy for all my hauls. But enough with me talking, let me share with you guys what I got at um, Pick and Save slash Kroger. I got my drink here, you know, because I'm running out of breath. So here we go. I don't even have room on my table. It's so full of bags. So the first thing I got is the Kellogg's Fruit Snacks. Now they usually have tons of Kellogg's Fruit Snacks on sale, but this one they only had just the Paw Patrol ones, which I thought was kind of weird unless somebody just didn't put all the tags on. So the Paw Patrol Fruit Snacks, they're originally one, or I don't know what the regular price is, but the sale price is $1.99. You know, so the prices that I give you, are, you guys, are the prices after the five, spend, uh, get five, get, uh, spend five, get five. So the, the sale price is $1.99, but if you guys buy five items, it takes off five bucks, making these just 99 cents. I think it's just easier, so I can share with you guys. And you guys, I did take a picture of everything so you guys can see what 
I did. So the buy five, whatever, 99 cents. Now we did have some coupons for these, but they expired. Or I didn't even check the Kellogg's Family Rewards website. You guys could check that out if you want to. But you guys would just get these for 99 cents. Now there it might be a deal on your Ibotta for 50 cents. I had a quarter. So you guys could get these for the final price for just 74 cents if you guys have a quarter like I did. So we're trying to cut back on fruit snacks a little bit. Uh, my husband eats them more than my son. I know it's weird. So I just got fruit snacks to um, get to share with you guys on that. Um, Skippy peanut butter. Now, please keep in mind, everybody's store is different. Everybody has different prices, different tastes and everything. But what I ended up getting is this Skippy peanut butter because we really needed some more peanut butter. Now, these were at my store $1.99. Now, I had a $0.55 cent off a two coupon that you guys could print from the Skippy website. But I ended up having a personal coupon that, you know, Kroger sends out personal coupons for what you buy. So I ended up having a $0.55 cent Kroger coupon that for one so I ended up using that so you guys depends on what you guys have for those personalized coupons but if you guys don't you can just print off a 55 cent off a two coupon making these just a dollar 44 is what I got for this so I like Skippy I'm not a very I'm, I'm kind of a picky person when it comes to name brand peanut butter um, there's certain products where I have to buy a specific brand um, I'm slowly starting to try other things but right now we're gonna do Skippy because that is that. Now I ended up getting Keebler cookies because I love these. I always love these. Now these taste exactly to me. These taste exactly like um, Girl Scout cookies, the grasshopper ones. They're just like thin mints, so I love to get these. Now these are also included in the buy, uh, buy five, get five. Um, these were on sale after that price for a dollar forty nine now there's not any coupons for these which I think a dollar forty nine for these kind of cookies are a pretty good deal but I actually had a dollar off a two Kroger coupon so I ended up using that so I ended up getting these for just about 99 cents a piece or dollar ninety eight which I think is a pretty good deal for 99 cents I and mean, if you think about it Girl Scout cookies when I was a girl was a dollar fifty to two dollars. Now they want four dollars. You can get the, pretty much the same cookies for the for a quarter of the price. I know I like to support my Girl Scouts, but I just hate how they cost so much. So there is that. Um, I ended up getting the little bites. Now I got a lot of. I didn't get a lot of food items. I got some food items. Uh, Benjamin goes to a daycare twice a week, and they kind of have a lunch. And he is a very extremely picky, picky eater. So I try to have him have some kind of snacks. Um, so he likes these little bites, and they're like three ninety nine around my area. It's crazy, three dollars and ninety nine cents. But with the buy five get five, these are on sale for a dollar ninety nine. Now I did not have any coupons for these, but I thought for a dollar ninety nine, this is a pretty good deal for his little lunch boxes. So I ended up getting two. He eats the blueberry muffin ones, and then he uh, I got him the party cakes. So got him those. Now these don't ex these expire in like a month. They don't last that long. But I'm like, you know what? I don't care. That's great it's little snacks for him to have. Or when he gets done with school, I have a little snack for him. Now, the Keebler Club Cookies. Now, this is not included in that buy five, get five. I actually had a free Club Cookies, or free Club Crackers or whatever. So I ended up just getting this. Um, I thought, why not? So we ended up getting those... Uh, yeah, so I, these were $4.19. I would never spend $4.19 on crackers, but I got these absolutely free with my coupon. I did not take a picture of that with the coupon because it's not included. Now, Quaker Oatmeal Apple and Cinnamon. I love this oatmeal. Um, I love oatmeal. I This is my favorite oatmeal. I have this as a snack all the time. But this was a dollar forty nine for the buy five get five off. Now some of you guys will have a dollar off a two coupon in the one thirteen. I didn't write what it was, but it was one thirteen smart source. I think a rip lump. I don't know. You guys can look it up. I never get those coupons from either either um whatever. What do you call it? Either inserts that I get. 
So I thought I just needed kind of just one more item to finish the spend five, get five, because I made little tally marks of everything I got. So I have an idea, because otherwise I just keep counting and counting and counting and counting. And I'm like, enough with the counting, it's getting ridiculous. So I just did tally marks this time. But if you guys have that coupon, they come out to be a dollar piece, which is a pretty good deal um, for the Quaker oatmeal. But I, like $1.49 is still a pretty good deal. I love this kind. So had to get that. Um, I got more food items. More food items. So I ended up getting the Chewy bars. Now I ended up getting the 25% less sugar because my son doesn't need as much sugar. So I got him the peanut butter chocolate chips. I feel like he eats these a lot. Um, he cannot eat these at school. They're peanut free at school. So I'm like, you know, these are a great snack for him to have at home. Now I did have a coupon for one of them to get one free. Otherwise, after the coupon, they're just 99 cents a piece, which I think is a pretty good deal. Now we did have coupons for those. They expired. I don't know if this coupon would work for the same coupon as the oatmeal. Not 100% sure, but one thing I do want to bring up for you guys when you guys submit your receipt, do it fetch rewards. Now my fetch rewards didn't catch this and I had to correct my receipt. I do that all the time, but I ended up having to correct my seat so you guys get extra points for buying these items on fetch rewards. Now fetch rewards, I repeat this every week, fetch rewards is my second favorite app. You just scan your app. You guys get extra points for buying certain products. Um, every receipt you scan, you get 25 points, but if you buy extra products, you get more points. So every thousand points is equivalent to a dollar. So I say start saving up, you know, start saving up those points so you guys can get a free Christmas. So got that. Um, okay, that's the last item in my paper bag. I ended up getting the Welch's got fruit snacks again. Trying to cut back on fruit snacks, otherwise I really like to stock up on fruit snacks. But these were just 99 cents after the spend five, get five. Um, 99 cents. We did have coupons, but again, they just recently expired. Unless your guys' store takes expired coupons. But definitely wanted to do that. So that was all my food items I think I got. And now I'm going to share with you guys my personal care items. So I ended up getting Playtex Sport. There is no coupons out there that I know of, but I had a digital $2 off Playtex coupons. Now I added these all to my card last night. So you guys should be able to add this to your account if you guys still do it. But there was a $2 off coupon on there. So I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to add it. You never know because I need to find some certain things here and there. So this was on sale for just $2.99. I had that $2 off digital coupon that I used. So I got this for just $0.99, cents, which I think is a pretty good deal, especially for Playtex. I feel like we don't get Playtex very often, and I am totally fine with that. Another digital coupon that I use is the Pampers Baby Wipes. Now, again, I think we're getting Pampers coupons in the PNG this weekend, but... I'm just showing you guys deals now in case you guys want to go now and then go again later. But we have a 50 cent digital uh, Pampers coupon. So these were what, $1.19? Where did I write this down? Uh, $1.19, you guys use that 50 cent off digital coupon. This comes out to be just 69 cents, which 69 cents for baby wipes I think is a pretty good deal. One thing I absolutely love is the baby uh, the baby wipes rewards. So what you guys do is you guys just um, put this code in the app and you get points. I've gotten free stuff from the Pampers rewards and now with another baby on the way, we got that going. Okay, so the next deal I got is with another digital, the Colgate Optic Toothpaste. Now, these were $2.99? I don't even know what these were. $2.29. $2.29. I'm like, I would not spend 99 cents on toothpaste, but it was $2.29. I had a $2 off digital coupon that I had from the, uh, the website that I clipped to my card. So I just got this for 29 cents. I usually say anything under 25 cents is a pretty good deal, but 29 cents for the optic whatever I don't care it's a pretty good deal so I got this for 29 cents um I ended up getting I think I lost something in my car my bag like fell apart in the car 
Well, I don't know what happened to it. it might be still in the car. Might have went under this. No, it didn't. I'm just blind. So I ended up getting the Whole Blends Shampoo and Conditioner. I like the Whole Blends. I've yet to use the Oat Deluxe. I think this is the next one I'm going to be using next time I need shampoo and conditioner. But this was not the greatest deal, but I still wanted to share with you guys because I hate wasting some coupons, especially some really good products that I like. Um, now, the only thing that sucks is these coupons, you can only use one per transaction. Now, some of your stores might let you use more than one. Um, my, the store that I went to, they're pretty picky. I kind of follow the rules, so I just do that. But these were $2.99 a piece. You guys want to use that three off a two coupon that we got in the 310 Red Plum, or Retail Me Not. Uh, you guys would just get these for $2.98, or just like $1.50 a piece. Again, not the greatest deal, but hey, I think $1.50 a piece is a pretty decent deal. Um, not the greatest deal, but a decent deal. So, wanted to share with you guys on that. Now, I did get a lot of shampoo and conditioner deals. Now, the Suave Kids, I love this deal. This is my favorite. The Suave Kids are just 99 cents after the spend five, get five. We have those two off of two coupons, which I think they expire this weekend, I think. I think. Um, but they're from the 210 Retail Me Not, so you guys will get these both absolutely free. Now, if you guys don't have coupons, I saw a lot of them have these 50 cent peelies. Um, I don't really use those peelies, but these are free and I love it. So those coupons let you use a limit of two per transaction. So I got four of them all absolutely free, which I love it. Yeah, one of my coupons, she couldn't get it to scan it. She's just taking it and like scanning it through the thing. I'm like, take that gun and scan it. So she gives it to me and I, I'm like, um, I did buy those products. And she kind of gives me that look and I'm like, use the gun. The gun will scan it. So she uses the gun. She's like, oh, I guess it works. I'm like, yeah, I gave you the right stuff. Some people are just lazy. Lazy. Now I ended up getting the Suave 2-in-1. Now this is the daily 2-in-1 plus. Now these were just regular 99 cents after the spend five, get five. Um, I used a dollar off coupon that we got in the 127 retail me not so you guys will get these absolutely free now we do have the three off of two which you guys could use also but I ended up getting the other swab products because I'm like it's still a pretty good deal and I wanted to get as much as I could with my you know more bang for my buck so got these absolutely free and I don't know if my store does over it that's the only thing that's the reason why I can't get this to work okay so the next deal I ended up getting is the Suave Gold. Now these were $1.99 in the 127 Retail Me Not. There's a three off a two coupon. You guys would just get both of these for 99, 98 cents or just 49 cents a piece, which I think is a pretty good deal. So you guys could use two of those coupons in one transaction. So I ended up getting four of them. So right here, you know, is two dollars worth of shampoo and conditioner i think that is a pretty good deal so i definitely wanted to get that now i wish i now this one this week these one coupons came out this one week i didn't get inserts and i wish i did because of the aussie and herbal essence deal um cannot find any of my stuff they're all in bags so what I ended up using is digitals but there are coupons out there so the herbal essence are a dollar ninety nine each in the two three retail me not there is a two off a two coupon you guys will get these for a dollar ninety eight or just like ninety nine cents a piece which I think is a pretty good deal for all shampoo and conditioner usually it should be under a buck um, the cheaper you can get them the, the better but hey still under a buck um, this used to be my favorite I used to use this shampoo and conditioner all the time until I started couponing then I stopped using it I should probably try it again because it's been a couple years but for 99 cents that's a pretty good deal now I did not have those coupons but I did have a digital coupon for two off of two so I ended up using it that way the Aussie deal is the same deal as the herbal essence um, again I did not have those coupons but I did have the two off of two, um, 
the two off of two digital. So these each came out to be 99 cents a piece. So I wanted to share with you guys on that. Now you guys don't have to do every deal I do. I do a lot of deals just to show you guys stuff. So just wanted to let you guys know like why I have so much freaking shampoo and conditioner. So the men's shampoo and conditioner, now they had some for $1.99. And they had some for 99 cents. I always get the cheap stuff because why not? Guys are not, half the guys I know are not picky about their hair. Except my husband. My husband. But he has used this stuff before. So this was 99 cents. These were 99 cents. Now we do have coupons in the 210 Retail Me Not for a dollar off. So you guys will get these absolutely free. Um, again, I think these some of these coupons expire this Saturday. So I might make a, another trip to go to the store to get more of this stuff because you can't pass up deals like this. So those were absolutely free. The Garnier Fruities. Now these were $2.29. $2.29. Uh, in the 210 Retail Me Not, there is a four. Now I get the hiccups. There's a four off a of two coupon. You guys would just get these for 58 cents. 29 cents a piece. That is awesome. That is awesome. I love it when I can stock up on Guardian Fruities. I hate how you can only use one per transaction. Um, and I, the thing is I would go through the, the self-checkouts, but then the cashier has to check all my coupons for me. So it's like, what do I do? What do I do? But definitely loved that deal. And then I have... One more shampoo and conditioner deal for you, you guys. Now, I might do another haul later on. It just depends. Um, depends on if I feel like it or not. But I ended up doing the L'Oreal Aleve deal. Now, these were $2.99. Now, in the 210 Retail Me Not, there is a 4 off a of 2 coupon. You guys will get these for $1.98. That comes out to be just $0.99 cents a piece. I feel like with L'Oreal, we get these all the time for $1 a piece, which I'm okay with. So, I got these each for a dollar a piece and that was my haul I know there was some items that I wanted to get but every store that I've seen you know varies so I'm like I don't need it I don't need it I mostly wanted to get that stuff um, I did not go shopping with Ben so that was a plus hold on I need a drink um, my total for all that stuff came to twenty nine dollars and seventy six cents now I can't remember if that included tax or not Usually I don't put tax in there because um, everybody's tax is different. My tax is 5.5. I've seen people with less. I've seen people with more. So, But my total came to $29.76. I ended up getting... Um, ended up getting 50 cents back with Ibotta. I had the 25 cent off the Kellogg's fruit snack. And then I had 15 cents for milk because I bought milk. And then I bought, I got a 10 cent off any receipt. So I ended up getting 50 cents back with Ibotta. So my total came to technically $29.26. So I mean, 30 bucks for all that stuff is an okay deal. Not the greatest, but hey, I think I did pretty good, especially with some of the food stuff that I got. Um, I ended up getting 36 items. That comes out to be just 81 cents a piece. So some of that stuff, I'm like, no freaking way would I pay 81 cents a piece. But some of it I would. But I ended up getting 392 points for Fetch Rewards. Um, that was for the Quaker items and then all the Suave. And I had to correct my receipt because it caught some of it but not all of it. That's one thing I don't like is it catches it but it doesn't. I don't know. But 392 for points. That's half of 50 cents I got back. Whoopee. So yes, that was my Pick and Save Kroger haul. I hope you guys enjoy these kind of videos. I do want to do more. I try to do them when I can. Um, so I, I will show you guys more grocery hauls, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and see you guys later. Bye-bye.